Welcome to the Notorious DID. I am Solara, and today I'm going to talk about what I like to do in my spare time. First, I would like to say I know that you see certain ones of us more often than you do others. None of the primary altars are the origin, and I am unaware of whom the origin is. I do not know. I personally originally thought that the origin was Danielle, but that is unclear, and I do not know if that is accurate or not. But whomever the origin is, they do not play a key role in the body. Myself, as I've mentioned in another video, I came about in 1998. Laura is another primary. I know that Laura has been around for a long while, but I am unclear as to how long, and I know that she is not the origin. Um, Valpray is one of the primaries now as well, and Valpray did not come about until 20, 2014, I believe. But... If any of us know or find out to clarify that, we definitely will in another video. Um, as I said, I kind of went off course, but I enjoy writing. I enjoy, even though I cannot spell, definitely some of the other alters can spell a heck of a lot better than I can. It is unfortunate, but true. And I have an entire video explaining how I love to draw and illustrate things. Besides that, I, no matter what I'm doing, I have to be multitasking. I have to have multiple things going on at once. So I may have something on while I'm drawing or while I'm writing, listening to television, well, not really television anymore, you can tell how old my thought pattern is, but um, listening to series shows or movies, I love entertainment of that nature. I love watching Korean shows, whether it be movies or their form of a television show. Um, really, really good programming. I also enjoy watching Chinese movies and their television shows. A lot of the ones that I watch seem to be based in Taiwan, which really I didn't even know was a part of China until I got interested in the shows. So you, you do kind of learn multiple things when you are watching these different programs. I watch it with subtitles. However, I am interested in learning Korean and I am interested in learning Chinese and I hope to do that. I have learned Hangul, which is Korean writing. And I know a few miscellaneous words, but that's it for right now.
I enjoy learning. I am very much into the process of learning new things and continuously learning, whether it be anything from computer programming to science to history to really just about anything except for math. I'm not a big fan of math. It's something that we require, but I'm not a big fan of math. I'm not going to sit down and write out any quantum mathematics that's just none of it. No, no, not for me. But um, I do listen to recently a lot of the Korean music as well. Um, outside of that, as far as something that would be here in the United States, I listen to a lot of what I guess you would class as pop or my, my range is, I have quite a range, but mostly I would say pop because you're talking about Lil Nas and Duncan Lawrence, some of Justin Bieber, just a lot of, a lot of different artists, Dua Lupa, I listen to a lot of different artists, and as I mentioned here lately, I mostly, mainly listen to Korean music. They have it to where you know, there are subtitles for Korean music as well, so you know what words are being said. And I just here recently got into a uh, K-pop group called Vix, V-I-X-X. -X. You should check them out. Really, really good music. And obviously, I listened to SS501, which I've put in prior links Sandu, Black Level. I just got introduced to Black Level. I am looking forward to learning more about their music. I listened to, and I'm going to leave her in a link below, because she really puts some excellent, excellent Korean music on her uh, YouTube. Her name is Universe Lyrics 18. And you should check her out because she puts the different lyrics so that you can read them. Very helpful. And you get introduced to a lot of different artists that you wouldn't ordinarily get introduced to, especially here in the United States. I know this is going to sound crazy because I write, but... I do not read fiction. I do not enjoy reading fiction myself. Even though I enjoy writing fiction, I love reading anything that has to do with learning, like manuals and, and information that I really love researching for the books. That I write. I love doing the research. I love finding out new things. It's very enjoyable for me to set. I guess you'd say I'm a geek or a nerd because I love just, I can set all day long and just watch or read things that have to do with learning new things. My TikTok feed or my YouTube feed full of different learning information, which I love the fact that you can learn a whole bunch of things in a little amount of time and just keep going and learning different things from different people. I also love, love the food videos. The Korean food videos, it's my cat Taz, 
the Taiwanese food videos, the Thailand food videos. It is so impressive to me that for the most part, they still make everything from scratch. I mean, here in the United States, let's face it, most things are in a box, in a bag, that came from a packaging company somewhere and are processed out the yin yang. Literally, you watch these videos and you're like, wow. His, I've watched some Thailand food videos here recently and I will, I'll link some of these things down there. Check them out because it is amazing. Literally, you see them take, like say, for a coconut product. You see them take it from A, right straight off the tree. They use the leaves. They do not waste anything. Nothing. And you see them take it from that. And you see all the processes that they go through as they're doing it. And it is truly amazing that these people still, from this day, here in 2022, do everything from scratch. Obviously, there are some machines and, and mechanisms and things like that that they use. But for the most part, they don't. It is all people doing everything. And I love the fact that that is true because we do so much with machines, especially here in the United States, that we're replacing human beings and taking jobs away from them that they could be doing. Well, that just gives you a little more insight as to what I like and what I enjoy. Like I said, I'll be more than happy to share links down below. Like, share, subscribe to our channel. Hit the notification bell. If you would like to learn our individual altars and our individual system, how everything works with us for DID and DID awareness as far as our particular system, we would love to have that. Um, we try our best to get a video out each day. This is to help us as well because communication is difficult sometimes and this helps us get along with communication know who's been there who hasn't and how the day has been and things of this nature so thank you so much for joining the notorious DID this has been Solara bye